So I started teaching in 2008 as a PPCD teacher. That's the preschool program for children with disabilities. So I have three through five year olds with special needs. Um, I have taught in the same classroom since I started in 2008. So that's been nine years. Um, I really enjoy working with the, um, the little, little bitties with special needs. They just melt your heart and I just really feel like I've been able to pour into them. I think she's very passionate about what she does and um, she comes in the classroom every day ready to teach her kids new things and it's real scary I think especially kids with special needs to come to school and a new place that's you know not home and I believe almost all her students love to be at school and that they're learning and growing each and every day. It's really important to understand that everybody comes in with different backgrounds, different special needs. It's very important to have those high expectations and to really work with them and see what they need for that day to make them successful. So I think that just looking at each kid and just understanding them and what they want and what they need. She is one of the top people in our school that is the first to volunteer um, to do stuff for our kids and she just she goes above and beyond with her kids in her classroom and makes sure that they're learning and getting every experience that they deserve to get while they're here at, at school. When I see a student make some kind of progress or they accomplish something, I, it just makes me feel so good because I know that they are so proud of themselves and I love seeing that pride that they have, that they accomplish something, that they learn something. I just feel so proud of them and I really feel like I've made a difference in those students lives in some way. Uh, she's just she's been a great friend not only is she my friend here at school our colleague she um, has become one of my very best friends just from you know meeting her here so I'm just I'm really happy for her and I'm really excited that she's a finalist for district teacher of the year.